Another yo-yo review to do today. So many cool things are coming out after Worlds. We've got to bust through some of them before they get released. So, uh, it's, you know, so that, so that I can tell you guys so you can get on these things. Because, yeah. Anyway, so this is the second yo-yo release from Throw Cafe. This is the Throw Cafe Cappuccino. So, uh, this is the Cappuccino colorway. I actually didn't get to pick my colorway. He was just going to send me one for review. But, uh... It's got a little kitty engraved in there, if you can see. I'll try to get a good picture on the screen when I do the uh, the, the thumbnail. I'll get a good picture of, of the cat side. But um, so, uh, but this was the this was the my favorite colorway anyway. So uh, mind meld going on there. So uh, huge thank you to Throw Cafe for that because this is beautiful. Um, and uh, so let me tell you about how I got this, and then we'll get into the specs and all that. So uh, I messaged uh, Throw Cafe on Facebook. I said, "Hey, I saw Nate's review." Uh, I review them too. I review yo-yos too. Uh, I would love to uh, review a yo-yo. I'm happy to send it back to you when I'm done and blah, 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 blah. Uh, I do this a lot sometimes. So they got right, up, right back to me and said, yeah, that would be great. I'll send you one. Let us know what you think. Uh, wait till uh, we've got some coming in. I don't have any uh, prototypes right now. They're all kind of in flux. But once the uh, first run comes in, before they drop, we'll get you one so you can do a review. And I said, that sounds great. Um, told them I could send it back to them if that was the, what they wanted, and uh, lo and behold, it showed up. Now it showed up in this awesome little, uh, this little, uh, these little plastic containers. I love these plastic containers. Um, the last couple of yo-yos I got have come in them, and uh, I, I can't say enough good things about it. This is an awesome way to ship a yo-yo. This is an awesome package for a yo-yo. It came with all this awesome stuff inside of it. Uh, the sticker was not uh, actually. Uh, the sticker was actually on like a sticker sheet, a um, little cool Throw Cafe sticker there, uh, but I stuck it on the top of this because I wanted to be able to take a good picture with the Throw Cafe logo on it, so, uh, plus I think it looks cool there, I think it was made for it, so maybe they'll ship like that, maybe they won't, I don't know, but uh, that's where I stuck my sticker, because uh, it's cool, um, but uh, anyway, so came in this awesome little package, and out came this awesome little yo-yo. Uh, Threw it around for a little bit after I opened it up and was like, "Man, I gotta, I, I gotta buy this. I can't." So messaged him, "This is mine now." So I bought this uh, because this is awesome. I have a ton of yo-yos and I have a ton of good yo-yos, and this is a good yo-yo. Uh, so these drop on Monday. Uh, today is you're this, you're watching this on Saturday. Uh, these will drop on Monday. So uh, prepare your wallets. Check out all of the uh, all of the Throw Cafe stuff is down in the description uh, for Facebook, the website, all that stuff. So uh, don't don't wait on these. The, these are these are excellent. But let's get into the specs. So um, this is a 56 diameter yo-yo, 56 millimeters in diameter, uh, 44 millimeters wide, pretty standard spec uh, yo-yo, very comfortable. You'll be a very familiar uh, feeling to you. It is a very light and nimble 62 grams. Uh, now, I haven't verified that, but it's definitely a light uh, 62 gram yo-yo. Um, comes with, I'll show you all the cool stuff it comes with. Uh, so that sticker, clearly, comes with a cool, like, it looks like it's just like a self-drawn cappuccino pin. I love that. It's going to go on my case, but I, I didn't put it on. It's going to go on my, like, soft case, but I, I wanted to show everybody first. And then uh, what appears to be just a yellow kitty string, which is great. Um, also comes with these weight rings that fit into here. Uh, so it's 62 grams without the weight rings and 64 grams with the weight rings. Uh, what's cool about the weight rings is they don't really introduce vibe. So this yo-yo is dead smooth, but when you put the weight rings in, not only do they look cool with this colorway, with the black, like it really kind of offsets it and looks cool, um, but it doesn't really introduce any vibe. Uh, it seems to spin a little longer and is a little more stable. Obviously, you're wear you're putting in more uh, weight with the weight rings, but I prefer it without. And it's still a long spinning and very stable yo-yo without it too. So uh, a cool addition. Nice to be able to switch it up. But uh, I at the moment prefer it without. Uh, but it's a cool addition to add a, to add two grams uh, to your uh, yo-yo. So yeah, 64 w grams with the weight rings, 62 grams without the weight rings. Um, 
and uh, check them out down in the description anyway. But, uh, yeah, love it. But uh, So anyway, uh, enough of me rambling about it. Uh, I just want to point out how nice this uh, colorway is, uh, and the finish feels beautiful as well. Um, absolutely up there with, like, CLYW standard of uh, finishes and of, of the yo-yo. But uh, let's go ahead and uh, throw it around a little bit. I'll show you what I mean. All right, guys, we are back with the Throw Cafe Cappuccino. Uh, so, gotta say, this thing's great. Uh, nice, light, nimble, long spinning, just good competition oriented type, but also lots of fun yo yo. Uh, yeah, this is really good. This yo yo is really, 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 really good. Uh, like I said, um, I. Uh, was just gonna have this up for review and then I was gonna send it back, but I liked it so much I just sent him money instead. So this is mine now, and uh, these drop on Monday. And uh, I'm telling you right now, that's uh, yeah, that's something you're gonna that's something you're gonna want to look into because just performance and fun and like overall goodness of the yo-yo. I mean. You could tell this was like really, really prototyped well and just really done well. You know what I mean? So, anyway, uh, moving on. The, uh, whoop, little snag. The, uh, the finish itself is very smooth. CLYW esque type finish. Um, I'm not sure what machine shop in China, but this thing grinds incredibly. Uh, does this finish, like, does this, like, whatever this coating is, or just this blasted finish, or if they can all kind of do that now, and it's just been an improvement that's happened, um, but this is great. I mean, this grinds awesomely, and the shape facilitates super long grinds. So if you like finger grinds, this is your yo-yo, because this thing finger grinds amazingly. This might be the best, one of the best, if not the best, finger grind yo-yo I have. So, uh, just, just killer, as far as that's concerned. Uh, thumb grinds, you could do them, the lip's a little small, but, uh, if you get it on an angle, you can absolutely get some good ones, uh, if you don't mess it up like I just did, but, as you can see, totally doable, um, as long as you get it on an angle a little bit, uh, you can catch it, and it, it's great. Um, as far as finger spins are concerned, there's like this little cap in there, sort of, but... I feel like it doesn't really get in the way. Like, there's enough room around it that you can get some real good finger spins on it, and it'll just kind of scoot around there. I missed the uh, whip, but that's mostly just me. I haven't thrown much today. I like to warm up usually beforehand, but uh, so much to do, so little time. So, uh, sorry, you get unwarmed up me. Definitely quick and stable, even at the super light weight that it is. Um, the uh, weight distribution is very good uh, as far as stability and light weight is concerned. Still spins a long time and uh, is absolutely super stable. You can kind of just do whatever you want with it. And it's like, oh yeah, I got you. I got your back. Um, very reliable type of yo-yo that's also fun to throw. Like, it's not just all rim weight and, and you know, a little bit of center weight for a long axle. Like, it's it's reliable, but also fun to throw. Um, can really kind of just facilitate whatever you want it to do, uh, which is awesome for a yo-yo like this. Like, it wasn't designed with any particular gimmick in mind. Just it was designed to be a good yo-yo. You can add a little bit of extra weight with those weight rings like I showed you before. So if you want it to be a little heavier, you can stick that in there. Uh, it is absolutely dead smooth. And I've taken this part a few times. Uh, absolutely dead smooth. Like CLYW, 10 out of 10 smooth. Um, uh, you know, without the weight rings. With the weight ring in, it's about 9 out of 10. Um, but, I mean, you are just putting in a... It, it's still like... It, you don't feel it on the string. It's absolutely like... I couldn't even show you in the video. That's how, like... It, it's really smooth still, even with that. But, uh... Dead smooth, without the weight rings. No vibe whatsoever. You can't feel it at all. None. None at all. Um, 
the bearing's very good, center track bearing. Uh, you know, I mean, what can I say about it? If you like, if this shape interests you, which it ought to, it's super interesting looking, uh, and you like finger grinds and arm grinds and hand grinds and all that stuff, and just everything. If you just like playing yo-yo, you're going to like playing with this yo-yo. It's really cool, uh, and uh, definitely something that I think you guys need to check out. Uh, I like it, clearly, and uh, I'm a paying customer, so... There we go. But, uh, yeah, let's take it back on the desk, take it apart, and uh, we'll do pros and cons, and that'll be it. All right, guys, we are back with the Throw Cafe Cappuccino. The Cappuccino. There's a little cat in there. He's so cute. All right, so let's uh, let's take this bad boy apart, show you what the guts look like. Uh, machined very well. Uh, screws apart. No, no issues with that, with when it screws apart, it doesn't stick. It feels very smooth in screwing apart. High quality machining. Uh, very, very nice. Um, little stainless steel axle in there. Center track-esque bearing. I'm not sure if that's actually a center track bearing or just one of those, uh, you know, sort of center track looking ones. It doesn't look exactly like a center track, so probably not a center track. Probably just uh, one of those generic ones. But still, very good bearing. Great bearing. Um... Center track is, th this this type of shape of bearing is my favorite, so uh, no surprise that it plays great with that in it. Um, those clear pads that I rave about, every, those like smoky clear pads that I rave about every time I get them, perfect response, long lasting. They look like the flowable, but they're not the flowable silicone, they're actual pads. Great pads. These are great. I love them. Everybody that puts puts out new yo-yos, put these pads in your yo-yos, they're great. Fantastic. And they look good in every yo-yo. Um, machining is good. Uh, as you can see, there's like lots of nice little intricate cuts. There. There's one there, there's one there, there's one there. Uh, it dents in here and then dents out here. Uh, just a just a cool shape overall. Uh, aesthetically pleasing to look at. Absolutely. And uh, the uh, this colorway, this is the cappuccino colorway. This looks amazing. Like it even looks like he like put uh, chocolate on top of your cappuccino with like the froth milk. It just, I mean, this is so good. Like this is so good. I love this. The attention to detail. And the artistry in this is just, it's, you could tell that they cared. It's a big, they, like, there's a lot of care that went into this, and I appreciate that. So thank you. Um, rounded over edge here, uh, just, I mean, a joy to play on the string. Very smooth yo-yo, very fun to play, uh, fun shape, great to grind. I mean, geez, I, I don't, I, I know I'm gushing over it, and I've been gushing over a lot of yo-yos lately, especially uh, new yo-yos by little companies, but man, like, I didn't get a chance to play a Mokta very long, and it seemed okay. Uh, but this cappuccino is like just, man, so good. These are, I mean, this is a great yo-yo. Uh, I can't, I can't stress that enough. That this is a great yo-yo, and uh, absolutely worth adding to your collection if this is uh, your type of thing. And uh, if good playing yo-yos that look beautiful and play great, and uh, you know, are super fun. Uh, is your kind of thing, then this is your kind of yo-yo. So let's talk about pros and cons. Um, pros to this yo-yo. Great, uh, well, let's start, start at the beginning. Great packaging. Sticker, great sticker. Uh, comes with extra frills. Gotta love the little pins and stuff. Um, the ability to add weight rings that both uh, are aesthetically pleasing and uh, add a different dimension to playing the yo-yo is awesome. Uh, and it's still very smooth with these weight rings in. I mean, we're talking it's 10 out of 10 without, probably 9 out of 10 with. Uh, so uh, really introduces no vibe by putting the weight rings in, which is really, really, really great. So, uh, I mean, that's just good engineering right there. It really is. So very good, very cool on the weight rings. Um, no, comes with the yellow kitty string. Uh, I mean, you know, can't say enough good about that. That's a great string to add to put in with your yo-yo. Uh, kudos to that. I mean, that's, that's awesome. Um, and uh, the design is just killer. I like, usually uh, I don't like laser engravings, but the understated little kitty in there, like you can barely see it if you're not looking for it. Uh, it's awesome. It's, that's my favorite, this is my favorite laser engraving I've ever got on any yo-yo. Period. Favorite one, hands down. Um, and this is a great yo-yo. Uh, I mean, I would say for the year, I think at the end of the year I'm going to do my top five favorite yo-yos that came out this year. Uh, this is in there right now. Absolutely. Um, it's probably not even like, it's probably like two or three at this point. Uh, great, great yo-yo. Uh, 
for a lot of good yo-yos came out in 2017, and this one's really, really good too. So, uh, we've been spoiled this year in 2017 with a lot of small new companies putting out a lot of good yo-yos, and this is absolutely one of them. So, continuing on the pros, uh, the uh, grind finish is great. Excellent, you know, it's becoming a standard uh, uh, excellence, but, uh, you know, maintains standard, grinds for days, great yo-yo to grind on, great shape to grind on. A lot of fun to play, uh, that's another pro, uh, just with all the the way the weight distribution is, but it's also very stable, very long spinning for as light as it is. Uh, you can play it quick, you can play it slower, a lot of control. Uh, most mono metals have a lot of control, and that's kind of why I like them so much. Um, but a lot of control with this one, so very, very good in that regard. Um, other pros is the finishes are beautiful. I mean, look, I don't know if I've seen... There's not a lot of yo-yos that look this good, uh, that have finishes this nice. Uh, a lot of a lot of companies are going to the fades uh, because, uh, you know, they want to do all the manufacturing in China, and not all Chinese companies can do good splashes and stuff, but... This this looks great. I mean, this is a good looking this is a good looking splash. Uh, this looks really good. It looks really good spinning, um, and it's just it's you know it's a really good yo-yo. Uh, as far as cons are concerned, I mean, I really can't think of any cons. I'm not exactly sure what the price is gonna be on on the on this. Uh, I know what I paid for it, but I think that was a discount because um, I'm reviewing it as well. But uh, I mean, I don't think, I think the last uh, yeah, yeah they put out was pretty cheap. It was like a $65 buy metal or something. And even if, even if this costs $65, like, this stacks up to $90 yeah, yeahs Like, this stacks up, like, if you put this next to a $70, like, uh, recess or a 90 or 95 or 80 or $90 uh, CLYW, I mean, this holds its own. Uh, easily that good. I mean, just look how good this thing looks spinning. Just look at that. How cool does that look spinning? Uh, this colorway is amazing, too. Uh, this is my favorite colorway. Um, and I didn't even get to pick it. It's just, this is what showed up at my door, and I'm so excited that it is. Um, like I said, not really any cons to, to speak of. Um, you know, no, nothing. Uh, it's no, There's no gimmicks. It's just a good yo-yo, and it comes in a good package. And... Uh, you know, I'm I'm pretty sure it's gonna come at a good price, but let's let me double check and see. But I don't think the price I don't know if the price is listed or not yet. But uh, man, you know what? I will put it down in the description uh, what the pricing is gonna be once I figure it out. But uh, this thing's awesome. So make sure you guys check it out. All of the applicable info is down in the description of this video. Make sure you leave me a like. Make sure you leave me a comment. Thank you so much, guys, for watching. Thank you so much, Throw Cafe, for sending me one of these a little early so that I could get it reviewed before it drops. Um, again, guys, make sure to like and subscribe. Cheers to you. And I'll see you next time.